Well, let's go back last game. You have a goal, you have two helpers, a nice three point night. What was working for you in that game? Uh, you know, I just try to keep it simple. Um, obviously, the help of playing with really good line mates and, and a nice uh, read by fighting on, on the second one um, just made, made my job really easy. It's got to be a tough situation on the penalty kill for a player like Austin Fighting. You got a guy running on a breakaway. You want to try and follow up to get that short-handed goal, but if you miss, you're down two guys as they're coming back the opposite way. You're one of the penalty killers on this team. How do you read a situation? Like that? Well, I think it's important to just kind of look look at what they have down ice. Um, other than that, like you got to have trust in your partner. So I think I have enough trust in Fighting to make that read because he's good enough, very easily a good enough player to. To make that read and pick it, pick his time correctly, and he did. So, you guys on the penalty kill, you're basically at 89 percent of our last 21, 22 games. Where is that surge, or what, what has been the reason for success of the penalty kill over the last 20 games? Um, you know, I think it's just continuous work. You know, we we play our system well, and it's it's a lot about bringing the right energy at the right time, uh, and again, picking and choosing your time when when you want to put that pressure. Um, and just really just buying into the system. You're certainly one of the faster skaters on this team. Has that always been a big part of your game, even playing junior hockey, collegiate hockey? Has the speed been your biggest asset? Uh, yes, I would say so. Sure. I've just always been kind of a faster guy, so sure. like and, playing a fast game. And, and obviously you can play that energy role on this team, and it, it's not always from a physicality standpoint, but really just the speed, the hard pressure on the puck that you can create for other teams. How vital is that in the game? All I know is that I just try to do my job. Um, if I'm doing what I'm doing, then hopefully uh, most people are, you know, trying to feed off that. And I just, like, I try to play the same way every night. So. You think Nicholas Hansen's distracting you because he's just jealous of your interviewing skills? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I, maybe he didn't quite understand the questions. Uh, Tucson Roadrunners this weekend, first place team, good hockey team. You guys have seen them twice this year. What do you expect and what's the approach to try and get a couple of points out of these games? We expect a, you know, a tough weekend. I mean, this playoff style weekend right here. Um, and our approach is the same approach that we've had all year, just play our system. And I mean, from my standpoint, I'm, we're not gonna over, I'm not gonna overthink it. Just, they're another team just like us. Just go have some fun and play.